men not understanding what it means to be a single mom. So as a single mom, a single working mom, I have my plate full to the maximum, right? I don't have free time. The time that I do have free, I just want to relax. So if you're really going to invite me out, one, make it worth my time. And what do I mean by make it worth my time? Joe's just don't invite me out to dinner and drinks. Get creative. Invite me out for an activity. Ah, the entitled single mother. Hey, this is Raul of Please Act Right. First, let me start off by saying I have nothing against single mothers. I know it's a hard and time-consuming job, but in this video, do these single mothers who make these videos understand that why are they giving us all these rules and regulations? That they're telling us all the reasons that you shouldn't date a single mother at the same time. Before we get started, I want to give a special thanks to Ray Bannister, Sergio Randolph, and Kyle Cray for your generous contribution to supporting my channel through Cash App. Please know that your support is greatly appreciated. So I want to talk about something that's been really, really annoying me lately. This is going to be it's about men, but single mom version. So something that's been getting under my skin is men not understanding what it means to be a single mom. So as a single mom, a single working mom, I have my plate full to the maximum, right? I don't have free time. The time that I do have free, I just want to relax. So when men ask you out, tell them that you don't want to date. You just want to relax. Problem solved. So one, I get it. I'm single. Yes. Do I want to date? Sure. If I meet the right person, right? But if you invite me out for a dinner um, or drinks, especially during the weeknight, come on. You know I have things to do. I'm sure you have things to do the next day. I have a child to take care of. I can't just go out late at night just whenever, right? Um, so you have to take that into consideration. She doesn't have the freedom to go wherever she wants, whenever she wants to. Okay, so that's one reason not to date a single mother. So if you're really gonna invite me out, one, make it worth my time. And what do I mean by make it worth my time? Joe's just don't invite me out to dinner and drinks. Get creative, invite me out for an activity. Do something different. Do something that's going to be worth my time and effort. I am taking time out of my evening to meet with you. So eating a cooked meal that you didn't have to cook and you didn't have to pay for is not worth your time. So if you're not on a date that evening, don't you have to eat? And wouldn't you have to cook it or pay for it? To go and enjoy your company, you know, to see how things work. If we're compatible, I'm making an effort. So I expect you to make an effort. So. So he took the time to ask you out on a date, effort. He came to pick you up to take you out on a date, effort. Now he's paying for whatever date he took you on, effort. Now where exactly is the effort that she's putting in that she's speaking of? Oh, I know, getting dressed and putting on makeup. Well, you gotta get dressed no matter where you go, whether it's a date or not. And as far as makeup is concerned, did he ask you to wear makeup? Don't just assume that I'm going to be able to drop off my child somewhere because most likely I'm not. So unless you're offering to pay for the babysitter, I'm not going on that date. Offer to pay for the babysitter. That's going to make me more receptive to want to go and spend my time with you. So the man has to pay for the date and pay for the babysitter for a woman he just met. Yet another reason not to date a single mother. Interesting. She wants to go on a date that she wants him to pay for but she's not willing to pay for the babysitter for the date that she wants to go on. Interesting. And another thing. You mean there's more? Do not just assume that you can invite me and my daughter out. No, I do not introduce my daughter to guys. That's a no-no, so. That's the first thing you said that makes complete sense. There's that, and also, don't just assume that you're going to invite me out for drinks and I'm going to show up. Um, what makes you think that I'm going to put my safety in jeopardy by drinking and driving? So unless you're going to offer to pick me up and drop me off or Uber me there and back, it's a no on the drinks during the week. Right, because you don't want to drink and drive during the week. So does that mean that you'll drink and drive on the weekends? So moral of the story is... Let me guess. Trying to date a single mother is too big of a pain in the ass. Come on guys, if she's a single mom, she already has a lot on her plate. So don't add to her plate. Don't make her life more stressful. Don't make her plan out the date that you want to take her on. Like, 
that's not gonna happen. So how many of you guys out there are more enthused at dating a single mother right now? So all I'm gonna say is do better and to everyone asking me out on freaking dates lately, literally if the shoe fits, then it fits, okay? That's all I gotta say. Once again, I have nothing against single mothers because I know it's a hard job. But everything that she said in this video really doesn't make men want to date a single mother. It's just too much to go through just to spend a couple of hours with you. On top of that, she threw her entitlement rant in there too. Also, there's something else a guy who wants to date a single mother has to think about. I don't encourage guys to take single mothers serious on a commitment level, on an exclusivity level, because baby daddy is always in them guts. Not always, but there's a possibility. Baby daddy is always on her mind, but you just a cleanup man. Kid ain't yours no way. To the ladies out there, whether you're a single mother or not, you know once you pass 30 years old, some of you all are looking for the cleanup man. But before I let you go, there's one more thing you have to consider when dating a single mother. Dating as a single mother sucks. I'm constantly canceling on my dates and it's because sometimes I can't count on her dad to show up on his days. Imagine if you plan to take her to a concert and you already bought the tickets and the tickets cost $100 each and she cancels. Man! Last, I'm already a single mom and my patience is like zero and any little stunt that he tries to pull or like any little miscommunication you're out i have no mercy no grace i don't have time for bullshit i'm not going down that rabbit hole again so any miscommunication and she'll dump you or for a short video this was a lot to absorb so fellas are you sure you want to date a single mom or are you just trying to smash if that's all you want to do communicate that clearly with her from the jump and if she says no keep it pushing but please don't try to get one of these single moms just for that. But pretending like you want it to be more. We already get a bad rap for being dirty to women as is. Trust me when I tell you, there are plenty of promiscuous women out there who don't have children that'll give it up to you without you having to lie. So if you're not serious about dating a single mom so that you can build a future with her, please leave these single moms alone. But make sure you take into consideration everything she just said if you want to date a single mom. Because they come with a lot of rules and regulations. Hey, somebody did to tell you, and I love you, so it might as well be me. Don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell to get notified when I post a new video. I post a new video every week. And in the meantime, will you please act right? My name is Raul. See you in another video. So if you enjoyed this video, check out one of these two videos right here. I'm sure you'll enjoy them too. And if you like, you can visit my channel. I have plenty of videos there. Go ahead. Don't be scared.